everyone, we're back. My name is Miska Tinger, and I am playing some Xenosaga episode three. <laughs> Don't know why I hesitated there. Um, so I spent about a couple hours during my stream yesterday doing some grinding and stuff in this game. Not necessarily grinding, doing some like side questing stuff. So I have all my dudes all kitted out, and I got the segment files done and all that jazz. So hopefully, this end game bit won't be so. Um, Difficult? Yeah. Am I supposed to go this way? Fuck. I'm not entirely sure which way I'm supposed to go. Doom, doom, doom. Oh, I didn't do it. It's been heavily damaged, but I don't think it was caused by combat. It doesn't seem to be caused by an atmospheric reactor accident or anything like that. It? What's it? It looks more like a natural disaster. Oh, they're just talking about the normal, like... It was Gnosis! Just ask Kevin. Where's the monster? That symbol. What is it, old man? I've been here before. It was in the distant past when I was still human. Over a hundred years ago! What? It was here that I faced off against Voyager. Back when this place was still called Abraxas. That testament was on this planet too? Yep! Yes. Voyager was born here, and it was here that he transformed and ceased to be human. Now we get to finally get a little bit of Ziggy Pass. Just a bit. Ah, fudge nuggets. Uh, you die. <laughs> Destroying enemy unit. Yeah, I'm a scotch overpowered right now. <laughs> Just a scotch. <laughs> this is fine. This is fine. If you think this is bad, you should see how my characters are on the uh, outside of ESs on the field now. Because <laughs> I got Erde Kaiser Sigma, and it only cost me a single MP to use them on Momo. But I'm close to the ending anyway. It's kind of- I wish I'd let you go inside the GFPD. It doesn't, but I wish it did. Night Moon! I don't know what that is. What is that? Ugh. Oh, okay. Uh oh, is a noisies. Oh wait, no, not a noisies. Is that noisies? Disembark the ES. Okay. Was not expecting. Was over here. Are we gonna go find Kevin's house? So easily able to destroy those. Doesn't even do the super big whatever the fuck. There's a bunch of flies around me. What the hell? <laughs> okay. What are you doing? <laughs> my rabbits are tearing apart a cardboard box on the other side of my room. What are you? Pets, am I right? Pets. Yay, money. I don't even really need money anymore. Not that one. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Is this one? What's in here? A box. It's a thing. It gives me more EXP, which I really don't need, to be honest. Bro. Bro. Bro, can I see what- can I see what's in there, please? Please? Oh god, the lag! Damn it! <laughs> There's not even gonna be anything in there, is there? There wasn't even anything behind it. Okay, let's go into this spaceport. I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh hey, look! A save point! 
This can't mean that we're gonna have some issues with a fighting in a minute here. <laughs> and by we're not, I mean we are. <laughs> Doom, doom, doom. Everybody's turned into Included. pillars of salt. This is. Yep. Everybody's turned into pillars of salt. Gnosis. This is horrible. Looks like a large number of people failed to escape and were left behind. Yep. But the platform was right there. I wonder how many spaceships managed to take off from here. <sighs> uh oh. What was that? It came from your necklace. You should be a little suspicious. You're not gonna be, but you should be. Xion! Chief, where are you going? There's something over here. <laughs> She's going off on her own, like usual, without any thought to the rest of her friends. <sighs> Xion, you were the worst. <laughs> also, you'd think Cosmos would have some degree of control over where the frickin'... Thing goes. What is this? It looks like an emergency platform. Is there something here? Dead mommy. I don't know. It's sadness? Fear? This is where Kevin shot off into space. I just feel something here. Chief. Which fight is this gonna be? Uh. Hi. Pelligree! <laughs> Hi, Pelly. This is gonna end well. We're gonna kill Pelligree. I never thought we'd meet in this place. I must remember to thank God, Jin Uzuki. So yeah, this this entire ending section is like, okay, let's murder every single character. <laughs> Until the end game. Pelligree. I have nothing further to say to you. Just just wrapping up those loose ends. We must stop the disaster that's happening on this planet. Neither Mars nor the Federation matter at this point. We have no reason to fight you. No reason to fight? Do you know what this place is? This place? It's Mictum, aka Abraxas. You set foot on this land without knowing anything about it? This land is the birthplace of Ormus. Not according to what Wilhelm said. <laughs> the birthplace of Ormus? Yes. Those born in this land were called the people of Zohar. The Zohar project, which your Federation pursued so vehemently, was originally brought into the world by us. So that is the heritage you care so much about? The people of Zohar arrived to this planet after their long wandering journey. We were the people who protected the Zohar, and the relics of God for generations. The Federation usurpers realized the potential of the Zohar, and invaded this planet, killing its people, in order to obtain the Zohar. And that ended the poorly. The is this. The current state of this planet is the manifestation of your Federation's ego and desires. We swore revenge, and vowed to restore this land so we may return to our fatherland. Wait a minute, does that mean that Ziggy is technically a per- like, people of the people of the Zohar? <laughs> so he's from Abraxas, aka Mictum? It is the destiny of my people who've lived on with the Zohar. It is the word of our god. I- <laughs> So that is the truth behind Milsha? It's true that you may be victims as well. But that doesn't justify what you did on Milsha. There's no need to justify. The words of God represent justice. Our existence defines truth. Yeah, that sounds a little bit like you're hiding behind your religion to justify atrocities. History shows that those who speak of the word of God have never represented what is right. Bam. All they've displayed was deception, falsehood, and aggression. You tell her, Jen. Yes, deception. It's true that it was all deception. What we did was all meaningless. Did Marcus tell Pelligree? What? <laughs> uh, what, Wilhelm told him? Yes, there is no longer a need for a reason. I am here now. This is my reason for being. I think he did, the way she is saying this. 
Jin. Remember that you are free. You can freely accept or reject anything you please. But I'm different from you. I can never join you. This was fated from the beginning. Then at least I'll end it with my own hands. I. <laughs> Pellegrin. Yeah, liter. Okay, the it's it's something that I didn't realize before. Margulis must have told um, Pellegrin what Wilhelm told him, and now she's just like, "Well, fuck it, guess I'm gonna go kill myself then." <laughs> like my god. Okay. Yes, it's a car. Time to beat the shit out of you. Or miss completely. <laughs> Could do that, I guess. Hard for the course of the way I end up playing this most of the time. Bum -bum. Also, um, you can have Jin in this fight. But there is a downside to having Jin because if Jin is in this fight, um, Pellegree will just be a line for him. <laughs> Pellegree will just attack the Ruben ES. <laughs> So, it is less, in my opinion, it is less ideal. I mean, sure, this is literally Jin's fight, because Pelagris is X, but at the same time, <laughs> it makes it a little hard to keep Jin alive. <laughs> eh, eh, got her! <laughs> cool. <laughs> she just Ani used an Animo Awakening, so it's like, uh, hopefully I can kill her before she uses that, because I don't feel like doing another round of charging. <laughs> Every, anytime you see an enemy doing an anima awakening, just charge everybody! Bail out, Pellegrin. There's no sense in you dying. You don't have to accept it! I told you, it doesn't matter anymore. Each person must walk on their own path. Your path and mine just simply did not cross. Then come on. Fight me one more time. Survive so that you can defeat me! <sighs> I can't fight anymore. I'm tired. Farewell, Jin Uzuki. Yep, she literally fought fought them, specifically Pelagrin. fought Jin, Jin. In order to die. So I'm like, they don't explicitly show it, but I'm like 99% sure that Margulis absolutely told her what Wilhelm told him. Fucking Voyager! <laughs> it's that ES again. It's Voyager. Fucking Voyager. Okay, time to go deal with Ziggy's shit. <laughs> hey, old man, what's wrong? Ziggy, are you okay? Obviously I not. Know where the Zohar is. Eh? Really? Where? My memory isn't complete, but there was once a facility where the Zohar was studied. We should head there. Okay, Ziggy Stardust. Something like that a secret this whole time. I wasn't keeping it a secret. My memory is fragmented and not linked properly. It seems I tried to seal it subconsciously. What? How come? I mean, also when you committed suicide, and that part will get explained soon. Um, Ziggy's suicide will get explained. But he also shot himself in the head. <laughs> like a little bit of memory loss. Cyborgs, kind of, nightmares. kind of be expected. I tried everything I could to. Nightmare. Kanan just tells Ziggy you used to be bros. <laughs> it is an abominable place. Yeah, Kanan just tells Ziggy you used to be bros. <laughs> the Archon Cathedral. And that and it's beneath it, the isolated research facility. Uh oh. Wait, no. This is this is this is false. I love you, I love you, but this is false. God damn it, I'm so <laughs> I'm so used to X being um enter sometimes. So Z Kanan and Alan are with the party here, which Kanan I get Alan is just for a plot device later on, it's like <gasps> but um <laughs> Where are they? There's no fifth ES that they're writing. Like, did they get stuffed in the wings of Dinah or something? <laughs> like, where are they? <laughs> Go to the Arkham Cathedral? Sure. Because the final shop of the game is also at the Arkham Cathedral. 
Um, and that's where you get Cosmos' ultimate weapon. Because unlike everybody else, where you have to do certain things to get it, Cosmos, you just buy her ultimate weapon in the fucking shop. <laughs> Which is appropriately utilitarian of her. Oh, hey, look, a dude blow it up. No, let me on. I'm just blowing up your. I'm just blowing up your sacred statue, okay? I'm just blowing up your sacred statue. This is fine. Just blowing it up. Can I? Okay, that's how I get it. Update file four. Cool. Is there anything over here? Doom, 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 doom. Fuck. <laughs> How was that an attack from behind? Fuck you. Oh, bye, Dinah. <laughs> I was hoping I'd have a second to be able to heal, but... Alright, let's go into the cathedral. This is gonna end well. Never mind, no it's not. <laughs> is this it? Yes. It looks like a religious facility of some kind. It's because it was. It's a cathedral built by Ormus to worship the Zohar. Pilgrimage meetings with the Federation and other such activities took place here. Yes, but that's only the official story. In reality, the research of the Zohar took place underneath. No wonder this place looks shady. All right, let's go inside. <laughs> you think anywhere that looks religious is shady, Junior? <laughs> Doom, 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 doom. Okay, well, he's obviously guarding something. <laughs> oh, yeah, pillar. Blow it up. That's not how a blown up thing like that would crumble. It would fall over. Bruh. Bruh. Bonk. Yay, a thing! <laughs> okay, you guys, that's gonna be it for this video because I'm gonna do some shopping! My name is Miss Growth Tanager and I have been playing some Xenosaga Episode 3. I'll see you all in the next video.